here is the machine we're talking about, uh, the DeLonghi Dedica EC685. I, I went specifically for this model because of uh, mostly this, you know, easy cappuccino and uh, milk proper. There are a couple of accessories that you have to buy once you have this beauty in your home. And first of all, you need a temper. So how you know which temper you should go for is you gotta take out this part. Um, and then I know that you always get this, uh, the plastic one but it's not really super high quality. I think I kept it in the coffee jar. So here it is. The problem with this one is it's not super high quality and it's, you know, it feels cheap and it doesn't have any extra added weight as well. Uh, so what I did is I purchased this one from Amazon. This has, you see, a, a nice wooden finish. So this, this looks really premium and this has a really nice added weight as well. So it's much easier to tamp your uh, beans here. And make sure that you know the diameter of this. I will write it below in the descriptions. So you can follow this diameter and, uh, or if you have different machine, you can just check the diameter of your uh, filter and then buy a tamper based on what diameter is needed. So you see this, this works perfectly here. So once you have your temper in place, it's easy to make your coffee, but then you will need a milk pitcher. So this is what I purchased also from Amazon. And the good thing here is you get an added um, thermometer here. And how it helps is you don't need to buy another separate analog thermometer. You can, uh, when you are you know, uh, frothing your milk, it shows you the right temperature and anything between 50 to 60 is good. Um, I, I usually use 55 to 65, uh, but I think, yeah, 55 to 60. Let's say that is really good temperature. And you can see here, I will show you when I'm making coffee, um, so you, you will understand how this is really, really helpful. And pictures are needed because without a picture, you won't get that circulatory motion uh, when you are frothing your milk. So this is really helpful. Make sure you buy one of these as well. The, the syrups that I use daily, or not daily, but that I use to make fancy coffees. So this is the Monin dark chocolate sauce. And this is really good. So you're gonna love it because so this is gonna help you make dark chocolate latte or dark chocolate mocha. Um, so yes, regular chocolate latte or mocha is fine, but as a person I like the dark version because it adds the strong chocolate taste and it, it doesn't taste sweet, which is, you know, really important for me. I don't like sugar. So this is the reason. I've also invested in um, a hazelnut syrup. This is called hazelnut for coffee. And there's no added sugar here as well so even if you add this it adds, it gives you this you know hint of hazelnut but it's not sweet which is uh, important also make sure that you invest in a good airtight container so for me i got this container from nearest shop called class olsen and how it helps is it has this lid which is airtight so every time you open it, you get this nice aroma of your beans and, and it, it doesn't oxidize the coffee beans inside. So the flavor is always fresh. <coughs> Another thing is the microfiber cloth. So you will need this uh, microfiber cloth to quickly clean your um, nozzle once, once you are done with the steaming your milk. So this is important because uh, you know, you wanna keep this clean um, and also once in a while definitely you know open this and uh, clean this in a in the sink So the bean I'm, I'm using is the Starbucks blonde espresso roast and why I like specifically this uh, This type of roast is because the roasting profile is you know, it's not super hard It's um, it's definitely not French or very dark So you get this nice aroma coming from the beans whenever you open the coffee bean jar and um, and you can feel. I mean, if it's good beans, you can really get to get to tell. And also, these beans have a really nice flavor, which I I love. 
but if you are more into darker or you know French roasted beans, you can definitely go for it. Ah, the smell, as I told you, it smells super good.